What is up guys? My name is Flaming Phoenix and today I just want to talk to you guys about Modern Warfare 4. A bunch of leaks have been going around. I like you guys probably have seen them around Twitter, Instagram or whatever, YouTube even. And I just want to talk about some of the leaks that I'm really interested in. Of course that happens. One of the major leaks that I want to talk about in this video is honestly just the score streaks alone have been leaked a lot. And right now I have a picture of I'm gonna have a picture up for you guys. What to expect from Offer 4 from GamingIntel.com, which like these leaks are very credible from very credible sources. One of them, a couple of the leaks have been leaked by this guy that like has leaked a ton of things about Infinite Warfare and they all came true, so Oh my gosh. Holy crap, nice little furry kill. Anyway, one of the leaks will be no specialist in uh, Call of Duty or Modern Warfare 4, which I, I love. I hate. I absolutely hate specialists. They, in my opinion, they're, they're just not meant for Call of Duty, you know? Like, in games like Apex where they have heroes which are basically specialists, I get it. But in Call of Duty, I just hate specialists, and I honestly don't think I will ever like specialists. It's fun to get a huge, like, kill feed with an Annihilator or, like, any of the other weapons, like the War Machine, the Flamethrower, and all that. But I just don't think they're fair, and honestly, that sometimes I don't even like to use them because I just think they're unfair. It's just not right. The one thing that I want to focus on today's video is the Modern Warfare kill streaks are going to be similar to both Modern Warfare 2 and Modern Warfare 3. So, it says right there, which I, I'm instantly happy about. Which means, the AC-130 could return, like, the tactical nuke is obviously going to return. That's one thing about, um, Treyarch games, and I think even Sledgehammer games. When you get a nuke, nothing happens. Or, Sledgehammer had the V2 rocket, so yeah, Sledgehammer games too. The only Call of Duty team that doesn't do like a nuke is like Treyarch games, like Black Ops 4 and Black Ops 3. They have a, an award saying nuclear metal, but you can't actually use it like in Ghost where the map would change if you get a nuclear, at least some of the maps. Or like you could actually get like, you know, kill the whole team or whatever it may be, you know? But in Bo Black Ops 4, you just get a, a nuke and that's it. You just get a metal and it's un unlocking. This is what happens when you buy a DLC. The lag! But guys, a nuclear is such a hard kill streak to get, nearly impossible from a lot of people. So I think instead of just getting a medal, I think there should be a huge streak that kills everyone in the lobby. Like, in my opinion, that's so rewarding and so nice feeling, and it honestly makes it worthwhile grinding up to get it. With Black Ops 4, though, you get a nuke, and that's it. Also, AC-130, if that comes back, the AC-130 was a very OP streak that a lot of people love, a lot of people hate. I love the AC-130. It's uh, I love overpowered streaks because they're hard to get, but once you get them, they should be OP. They shouldn't just get destroyed by Zero being the specialist, or just not do that well. Like, sometimes the strike team will get 5 kills and that's it. Which is a decent amount, but I would really prefer, like, something more extreme. Like, I remember Black Ops, I think it was Black Ops 1, attack dogs were just would shred through the enemy team like it's nothing. Of course, the UAV will appear. Um, the Predator missile might appear. I'm not sure. Sentry gun obviously is going to reappear. I'm pretty sure the Pavlo is going to appear. But I honestly, here's a picture of some of the streaks that might come back, which is all these. I just, I know for a fact a, the nuclear is going to be an actual streak, just like in all Modern Warfare, Ghost, you know, Infinity War games, and Sledgehammer games. I love it. I cannot wait for it. It's going to be amazing. In my opinion, just having AC-130 would be amazing. And other than that, I would probably like the Predator missile to return also, but we always get like Predator type missile type kill streaks. Like the Hellstorm missile, but I also hope they have even more newer kill streaks that are even more crazy. Like I'm pretty sure the Thresher we've had in Black Ops 2, I might be wrong, or something like the Thresher in other Treyarch games. So I hope they 
bring more newer kill streaks in the game. Because a lot of the streaks from the Call of Duty games are pretty similar to the ones we've already had. Like the strike team is pretty much the paratroopers from World War II. I also hope they make team deathmatch up to 100 points instead of 75. Because obviously, you guys probably know team deathmatch is usually at 75, but Black Ops 3, I think, is that Black Ops 3 had 100 because the games would go by so fast. And then Black Ops 4 did 100 also. Be It was at 75, but then they changed it to 100, which is awesome. I just think Team Deathmatch should be at 100. It just feels nice, you know? And there we go with the melee weapon again. There we go. Not a bad game. 58 and 4. That's a really good game. You know, I was lagging here and there. Guys, I cannot wait. Oh, I got the file. Oh, this is one. Yep. I can't wait for Marvel 4 to come out. I. I've always wanted a Modern Warfare game since Modern Warfare 3, and we haven't got one since Modern Warfare 3. I, I would count Ghost as a modern game, but other than that, it's been like a long time since Ghost, too. So it's been like three, six years almost. Go it's been a while since I played Ghost, and I love Ghost. Some of you guys love Ghost. Some of you guys hated Ghost, but now that it's Modern Warfare 4, I think everyone's going to love this Call of Duty. It's going to be so amazing, and I can't wait. There's a lot more links I'm going to talk about in other videos. But I just wanted to focus this video on kill streaks. I can't wait. Make sure to drop a like and subscribe for more Call of Duty views just like this. But most importantly, enjoy your day as much as possible. And I cannot wait for Modern Warfare 4. Baby.